A new monument is celebrating Des Moines historic streetcar era. KCCI's Amanda Rooker explains what the development will bring to our city. If you aren't paying close attention, you might just miss it. Trolley tracks running along University Avenue, a piece of history just below the surface. This is literally where the um, streetcar turned around. So Emily Naylor works for Shive Hattery Architecture and Engineering, a group working to build a monument on University Avenue that will commemorate the streetcar era in Des Moines. It's just a kind of a derelict uh, bit of land that's been neglected and we're just going to do some great things with it. The monument will include a streetcar sculpture, a small park with benches, and informational panels with history of Des Moines' trolley system. The Waveland turnaround loop was built 120 years ago to bring people here to the Waveland golf course. And although streetcars stopped running in the 1950s, it's not the end of the line for trolley's historic legacy. At a time, there were streetcars every two and a half or three minutes. With hard hats and shovels in hand, project leaders like Earl Short gathered today to celebrate the new development. Short's father was a streetcar operator at the Waveland Loop, and he says this monument means everything. The history of the streetcar era, that's the main thing. And I want that to be passed on. There's not a lot of people today, living today, that even remember the streetcars. So this is one form of what we can do to help them remember it. In Des Moines, Amanda Rooker, KCCI 8 News, Iowa's news leader. Well, the streetcar monument is scheduled to be complete next spring. It's project of the Des Moines Historical Society.